a novel laparoscopic approach for the management of undescended testis. A five-year-old boy presented to us with left-sided undescended testis. The testis was not palpable even in the inguinal region. A 10 mm camera pore was made through the umbilicus. Diagnostic laparoscopy revealed left testis just inside the left deep ring. 5 and 10 mm working ports were made, triangulating with the camera port. Gradually, dissection started with mobilization of the spermatic cord by insertion the peritoneum across it. Peritoneum was mobilized and incised. We confirmed there was no long looping vas. Peritoneal mobilization was continued. Gradually, the gubernaculum was narrowed. The gubernaculum was completely disjuncted. We continued the mobilization on the medial side. Care is taken to identify the vas and not to injure the vas. Lateral peritoneum was also mobilized and released. This helped in ease of mobilization of the testis. Lateral peritoneum was released. The adequacy of the mobilization was checked by drawing the testis to the opposite side deep ring. Through the left scrotum, an 18 French PCA needle was inserted medial to the inferior epigastric artery of the ipsilateral side. A guide wire passed and along the guide wire using ampler sheath, serial dilatation of the tract was done. Serial dilatation was done. The peritoneum attached along the tract was slightly released for the ease of mobilization and to make the tract more patent. Serial dilatation continued. We dilated the tract up to 32 French with ampler sheath. Over the dilator, we placed a 12 mm laparoscopic troker. The testis is delivered out via the 12 mm troker outside into the left scrotum. As you can see the testis is being delivered out. The troker is gradually withdrawn. Subdartos fixation of the testis was done in the left scrotum. As we can see, 
the test is, is being fixed. Skin is closed and you did check laparoscopy to look for any bleeder and to see there was no undue tension. On follow up the child is doing well.